Hey guys, Puppy471 here, and check out my sick V. Just kidding, guys. We're doing the worst TV commercials. Again. So yeah, I didn't do the worst TV commercials yesterday because I thought it would be a it would be a great time to take a break from uploading. I mean, I'm uploading so many videos, man. And I think that it would be fine to um take a break. This will be my last video until I have a two day break. Just kidding. I'm just gonna be doing videos every day because I don't know what to do. It's just so fun. It's, I'm just going to be uploading videos more frequently now, just because I just got to get used to recording videos, and then I'll take a break from recording. So yeah, this might be happening for a month. And so our first commercial, our first um, piece of advertising garbage that we will be reacting to on the Worst TV Commercials Part 9 is Nationwide's Boy Commercial. Nationwide. Alright, let's, let's react to it. Hey, wait! Fast, wait! Wait! I'll never learn to ride a bike. Wow. I'll never learn to ride a bike. That was definitely... That was definitely five-year-old me. I'll never learn how to ride a bike. Or get cooties. Why do those cooties look a lot like hedgehogs with baby faces? I'll never learn to fly. What kind of child does that? Is this some Albert Einstein big brain child? What kind of child does that? Or travel the world with my best friend. And, they won't and also, is that a tub? Ever get married? I couldn't grow up because I died from an accident. He died. If that's true, how come you're still here to tell the tale? Nationwide, we believe in protecting what matters most. Yeah, I don't know what children dying has to do with insurance. Your kids. Together, we can make safe happen. Ah uh, yes, that was the same tagline that they used for the Spongebob commercial. Nationwide made a Spongebob commercial. And the commercial was even better than the than the actual new Spongebob episodes, not gonna lie. Nickelodeon, could you just be better? I mean, just stop it with the dabbing already. Just stop it with the dead memes. Just stop it, Nickelodeon. I know it makes you a lot of money, but could you just make good shows? The children... They might still like it. Could you at least put a little reference? And... Also, I think the tagline might be very good to use today. I mean, together we can make safe happen. That's a good tagline for what's happening right now in the coronavirus outbreak and everything. You can still do good things in the coronavirus outbreak. I mean, I'm making a ROM pack for Sega Genesis. You're about to be mad. The next, now, that commercial, I mean, I don't know what to say about it. I mean, it had a good... It had a good, um, um, advertise, it had a good, um, message in it. I'm just gonna give that, like, a, a two or three, I mean, I don't know. This next one is Fushigi Ball Commercial. Wait, that's too long. 
This again is way too long. You want to keep This is this is too long. All right, Bizarre Loves Baby Soft 1975 TV commercial. This commercial is old as is as old as my mom. Let's see what it's about. There's one person nobody can resist and that's a baby. So love made baby soft with the innocent scent of a cuddly clean baby that grew up. What? 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 You got a woman eating a lollipop. I'm not sure that's how you eat a lollipop, miss. You have to suck on it first. All right. Boy, this sounded w very weird. It's, it's not, there's nothing wrong with sucking on a lollipop. All right? There's nothing wrong with that. But a woman doing that? But a grown-up? Woman just biting, but just biting into it like it's food. It's that's wrong. It's not a Tootsie Roll pop. Also, this is kind of creepy because it looks like it was made by a pervert. Very sexy. Informing bath, body lotion, body powder, and body mist. <laughs> this is like the um cursed like 40 like like 45 year old dollar shave club if it made if it was cursed so innocent it may well be the sexiest fragrance around loves baby soft because innocence is sexier than you think for your baby at christmas So, I'm going to give that commercial, it was very cursed, for, um, I'm going to give them the eating food wrong tax, and that gives you, um, two points for showing someone biting into a lollipop, like it's a Tootsie Roll pop, and you can't, and you just have that urge to bite it, even though you just want to get to the center, which I have got to the center once, but it was one of the small ones. And it also had the grown woman acting like a baby tax, which um, gives it three points. And that gives you five points. This one's too long. How many licks Tootsie Pop commercial? Wow. Remember how I was just talking about Tootsie Pops? And how many licks it takes? And getting to the center of it? Somehow this, com this commercial was next. <laughs> what a coincidence, am I right? Ellie, your homework! Ellie, your homework! Ellie, your what? I thought that this was gonna be... 2D animation owls, a kid. Remember that commercial? That one commercial that needs to be taken off the air. It's too old. The one really old commercial that still airs somehow. Excuse me. Yes. Can you tell me how many licks to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Perhaps. No. I'm going to. No, I am going to eat you. At the center of every Tootsie Pop, there's a chocolatey, chewy Tootsie Roll. Begin the count. One, two, two. You bet. You bet. Allow me. One, two. How many licks to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Three. The world may never know. We bet. We bet. The world may never know. I mean, that's probably correct. I don't know. That that commercial was kind of cursed. But it's, it's kind of normal.
but at least that one got took off the air. I've never been so happy to see a 40-year-old commercial. Maybe there's a reason why they why they don't why they don't put that commercial off the air. I've never been so happy to see a to see a probably 50-year-old commercial air nowadays that needs to be taken off the air. Next one is Sales Genie. 100 free, free sales leads. Panda Super. All right. I don't know anything about these companies. Excuse me? I'm not Chinese myself, but this is kind of racist. Ching Ching. Their names are Ching Ching and Ling Ling. Tails! We're going out of business! Ling Ling, I am not going back to the zoo! Then we oh, it says sofas with a Z. Oh, you racist. You racist, man. You racist as hell. You know what? I've never been so happy to see a Chinese stereotype ever. The 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 psychic looks worse. They're, what kind of panda has a head shape like that? Tell Ling Ling to get one hundred free sales leads at salesgenie.com. You could have made him use a Chinese computer, but you didn't. You didn't. You didn't make him use a bootleg computer. Wasn't that the whole point of the Chinese stereotype? To make something bootleg in here? And stop eating the bamboo furniture. Wow, wow it's a panda stereotype. What why was he eating the computer? He could, that's probably like he's probably got computer chips inside of him now. That's that's bad. Look at all these sales leads! Thank How you, come? Sal he just took a freaking bite out of that. How come, how come the computer still works? Genie? Hey kid! Also, why is he not eating the car? Because the car's made out of bamboo, too. You wanna go see the grizzly bears at the zoo? For what? And they now randomly have babies. They're babies, they can't talk. And also, one of them looks like they have a mustache. Got free sales leads? Go to salesgenie.com! My new computer. Well, that is a bad commercial. You got the um, Chinese stereotype. You got the stereotype tax, which gives you five points because that's kind of racist. It's very racist, actually. And you got the um, badly animated. And you got their um, stereotypical names on there, which immediately gives you four points. So that's a nine. That's a nine out of ten. That's a nine out of ten. This is bad. All right, so I think that's all for today's video, and I am not going to do an intro and outro on this. Because I mostly do that for the Jaden show, and sometimes when I feel like it, I'll do that. So bye.